We'll wait for the thunder to pass. <laughs> I, uh, nothing like wanting to source your food as locally as possible. I went looking for pickling cucumbers because somebody brought me a whole bunch of peppers. And, um, it is raining. This is our first big storm and it's August. We're all talking about how unusual it is for the rain to be in, for it to start raining like this in August. Like we have thunder and lightning overhead like crazy. And silly me, instead of staying inside, my hair is dripping down my back. Instead of staying inside, I decided, hey, let's go to the farmer's market and look for pickling cucumbers. Mm -hmm. Now I would have taken you to see the little farmer's market here in Nesquin, Oregon. It's just a little, it's just a little farmer's market. I would have taken you out there, but I don't want my phone to get wet. So do you remember last year when I took you through the grocery store and I was showing you what I do and don't buy? There's only a few things I buy from the grocery store and I go once a year pretty much. There's a very, I haven't been to a grocery store in four months, like four months for anything major. I went for a good corn sale because it was 10 for $5 and I bought corn because we were having company, but I haven't like really been shopping. I mean, we just grow and make do with what we have. That shook the car. That literally shook the car. I better get out of here. Um, we'll, we'll, we'll talk about this in another video. Um, but yeah, that shook that shook the car. <laughs> I'm a little crazy, right? But when I was in that video, when I was in that video doing that video, I was showing you what I didn't, what I no longer bought from the grocery store. I'm removing myself as much as possible from the grocery store. And when I don't have it growing in my garden, because for some reason my cucumbers are just like still very tiny. They like did not take off at all. Um, pretty much from where by, because of where I planted them. So the next thing out of that video that you saw going to the grocery store, the next thing that I want to remove uh, myself from is pickle relish because one of you guys made a comment about how, oh, it's high fructose corn syrup in that. And when I read the directions, I was like, really, really? Why do they have to put that in pickle relish? So I have found some sweet pickle. I have water dripping down my back. I have found some sweet pickle relish um, recipes that are really great that I can use organic sugar with and I don't have to use high fructose corn syrup with and we're going to go back and make it, but not right now. Right now, I am going to go home and dry myself off because I literally was, was shopping in there. Dry myself off and get a nice warm cup of coffee. We'll talk to you guys later.